Hey everyone, if you're using RetroArch on an iPad, on iPhone, something with a touchscreen, you might want to get rid of this user interface on screen. So these are the touchscreen controls, which you might want to get rid of, if, especially if you are using a controller. So these kind of get in the way, they're kind of ugly. Today I'm going to show you how to do that. So this is pretty straightforward. What we need to do is press the icon here to get into the RetroArch menu. And then what we want to do is to go to the configuration menu here. So tap on this cog icon. And then we want to tap on user interface here. And then we're going to scroll down until we find on screen display. So tap on this. And then what you can do is basically turn off the on screen display here. So you do that by just tapping, and then that's all going to turn off. And then we're going to press the play icon to go back into the game. So uh, we can now control this game using the controller. There isn't any button on screen which is going to affect your gameplay anymore. So make sure you have a controller attached. And uh, of course, the home button is going to go and inspect to the menu. You make sure that that's configured. Otherwise, you're not going to be able to get back in very easily. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.